So many things are happening. Our history, it's taken on a whole new life. We were awarded the best historic small town in America three years in a row. But then we have this great new vibe here as well. Yeah. And so that's what we're going to show you this time. Hello. Hi. Hi. Welcome to Hotel Lucy in the Pearl. How can I help you today? So we are checking in for the awesome. weekend. Yay. We're so excited to have you here. Thank you. We're excited yeah. to be here. Some of the fun things that we can sell here at oh, the Pearl. Cute. Everything from bath bombs to the shampoos and conditioners. Just anything and everything you could use to relax. We've got it here for you. Follow me this way, we're gonna go into our Big Lucy house. This is the largest house that we have on property. It has seven of our suites. So oh wow. They're gonna have king size bed, larger floor plan. Some of them will have a tub and showers. They're decorated to the extreme. Check out that bar. Yeah, so this is the Big Lucy Lounge. It's oh, so okay. chic and fun. Yes. It's girly, I love it. This definitely helps embody kind of the spirit we want Lucy to have, yeah. which is fun, funky, very fresh, modern. We want to definitely bring that to Granbury as well. And this is one of the most popular common spaces that we have. So if you want to follow me this way, I'll show you one of our Lux suites. Yes. So Miss Vera used to be a local here in Granbury, okay. and she actually had a fruit stand here in this little corner of the house before it was built. Stop yeah. it. So this is the Vera Parker, named after her. <gasps> oh my goodness. You step into Hotel Lucy, it already blows your mind how beautiful it is and how fun it is. Then you come into these rooms and they are so chic. Consider Lux because you have the seating area, yeah. larger floor plan, the bathroom is immaculate as well. So much space and shoot, I mean, I may move in. This is a great spot. Oh my gosh, we thought it would be perfect for you. Howdy, howdy, ladies. Hi. Welcome. Hi. Joy to have you here today. Thank you. So you've already got started with our margaritas. I did. <laughs> you also got our uh, armadillo eggs. Our armadillo eggs, we make them all in-house. Hey, I'm gonna recommend, it's great for the summer, it's our prickly pear margarita. Yes. It's very pretty, very delicious. Does that okay. work? Yes. Okay. Pretty and delicious, yes. Yes, welcome to Granberry. Thank you. So what's new to Granberry that we should get to know? Oh, there's so many things. There's nothing like seeing Lake Granberry from the water. So the Tiki Cruise is one of our favorite new attractions. We also have new wine tours. That is always exciting. And then later tonight, we are taking you to Warren's backyard. You always roll out the red carpet for us. Well, we're so proud you're here. And you know, we have this great history that is our foundation, but then we have, always have new things and we you know, evolve and change with the times. And so we're excited to show off all this new stuff to do. Love it, let's cheers. Cheers. Welcome back. Thank you. Good to be back. <laughs> Stick around, our time in Granberry continues right here on Yolo, Texas after the break. Kind of our philosophy and our attitude was when you step off that dock, we want you to leave whatever troubles you have behind. Come on out, have a good time, and enjoy. You can see in the distance our courthouse, which is a beautiful, beautiful area. And that's where the webcam is mounted, and you'll be able to see that and follow it online. So how cool is that? You can see us going by Look at that. the webcam. We really do pride ourselves on being the friendliest little tiki cruise on Lake Granbury. We might be the only one, but we're the friendliest one no matter what. Our new Warren's Backyard Texas Music Venue is amazing. Like an Austin vibe in Granbury. Everybody loves it. 
Ready? Are you ready? Two shots fired. So realistically, you want half a shot, a black coffee, and then a white chocolate liqueur, a pecan whiskey, the dirt they're buried under, a little, co co a little cocoa for the topping. Two shots fired. Good county history, hometown hospitality. Good morning. Good morning. It is so good to see you. Welcome to Oz. It was definitely inspired by the Wizard of Oz. So you have the yellow brick road that brings you here. That's where you'll <laughs> find me is our motto. Everything here kind of is inspired by that and we're just happy, happy that you're able to come and visit us. Awesome. May I recommend the Wicked BLT? That's what we're famous for. Absolutely, okay. I would love that. Well, we'll Thank get you. Chef Rose to start on it. So today, you're going to get a little bit of flavor of Granberry's history. We have a new City of Granberry Cemetery tour okay. that has become very popular. Everything from history to dolls, the Dollhouse <laughs> Museum, with over 6,000 dolls. So Holy smokes. Um, we are also going to our historic train depot. Uh -huh. That will be fascinating. Our historic gel, which if you've never been in, is a must-see here in Granberry. Oh, and wow. then we're going to take a trip through the Bridge Street History Center, and it is a storytelling museum. So we're going to take you back in time today. Cool. Hi, Erin. Hey. Mariella. Nice I'm going to be your tour guide today. Here's the brochure. You've got a map. We've got the grades. And I want to tell you some interesting stories. Awesome. After we won the best small historic town, we realized that people want to find out about the people that lived here and any information that could be gotten from visiting the graves, especially people that are looking for ancestors and that type. It looks like we're approaching one, actually. Yes, actually, this is General Granberry's grave. Oh, yeah. He died at the Battle of Franklin. His remains were brought here and buried along with his wife. Okay, so on this map here, yes. I also see number 23 is Jesse James. Is that correct? Yes, as far as we know, he's here. 